Hi, hello, good day. Welcome back to Jay's Bees. Uh, we're here for another inspection, and today I've got my little helper. This is Emily. Hi. That's it. And uh, she's it's her first time at the hive today, so she's going to help me out. Um, so I've tasked her with a few little things to look out for. She's going to look out for drone bees, drone bees, queen bees, queen bees, and what else? And do the smoker. And do the smoker. That's it. Well done. Uh, she knows how to light it, but. Obviously, because she's young, I won't let her light it. But um, yeah, so she's going to come up here and help us. She looks ever so cute in her little bee suit. Hey, it's a very lovely warm day today. Um, the bees are active as always. Um, yeah, so it'd be a nice experience for her. Um, she's a bit apprehensive, which is understandable. But um, yeah, as long as we keep her safe, uh, it should be okay. We we'll, we'll, should be fine. Both fine. It's, Interesting to see the inner workings of a beehive. Uh, it's all very well seeing these bees flying about collecting pollen and nectar, but you know what they do with it is is another thing. So, for her to see firsthand inside a hive, I think it's very it'd be interesting for her. Well, I hope so anyway. You, you never know. Um, so yeah, brilliant. Right, so little Emily back in the shake. It's very warm today. I reckon it's probably about 24, 25 degrees. Um, it's very warm. The Bees are out foraging as you can see, um, so hopefully there shouldn't be too many bees in the hive. But we're hoping to see a lot more merge, emerged bees today. Uh, we'll try and get a close up of hopefully a couple of little bees coming out, uh, a little better quality than like last week's video. We shall see. Um, yeah, we should, it, it should be highly productive in there. Uh, we've got to look out for queen cells again this week. Uh, hopefully, they will start drawing out the frames in the super as well. So. Uh, that should have given them enough room, but yeah, we need to keep a look out for the queen cells because we might decide to split the hive uh, We've got my second little nook box there ready if we do decide to um, But yeah, just on a quick generalization inspection first inspection for Emily as well, so um, Don't want to be hanging around too long because it's quite warm especially in a B2 So right, let's get kitted up get the smoker going and Let's have an inspection and hope you enjoy it too. So We're ready when I you to come round Point the nozzle at the front and give it a couple of little squishes. Yeah, on this side. Let's go. That's it, right down at the entrance. That's it, good girl. So the smoke, you can smell the smoke going up, that's it. All done. Now come around here, you put, put the smoke off down, that's it. That's it, good girl, well done. Right, you'll pick the brush up. Come and stand over to the left. It just stand there, that's fine. Just double check. It's fine. All right, let's have a look and inspect. Right, let's have a look. Top boxes. So you've got to look for the queen on there, but it won't be on there because we've got a queen excluder in it. Uh, just down here a little bit left. We're starting to draw these frames out. See all the little bees in there? Mm -hmm. But we'll have a look at this box last. We'll have a look at the main hive. So we'll lift this off. Look at all the bees. You grab the smoker, please. Let's see, put that, put the brush down, isn't it? You got it? Good girl. That's it, give him a little smoker over the top. That's fine, we'll just try. They won't rush to get down. So you got, this is the hive, the hive tool, used to peel it away. See, they're, they're building loads of comb there, look. We'll turn it over real quick look make sure the queen's not on the back now remember the queen's got a green dot on it yeah no, there's no queen on there no. so that can go on now that might have been I 
uh, cover this frame with a bit of brace kind of. Come on. So you've got to keep an eye out for a, a B with a green dot on it. frame in turn. Uh, no, it's fine. It's just a bit stunned maybe. Oh, that's a heavy frame. My word. Look at all of that. Mm -hmm. Have a quick look. Look at them. Busy, busy, busy. Oh, look. Right, show you what a drone looks like. See this one here? Yeah. How big he is. Oh. See? See the size of his eyes. Oh. Yeah, that's it. Good girl. That's a drone. Yeah, good girl. So all this is capped nectar. So all the nectar they've collected, this, this then turns into honey. In there, all these yellow, yeah. that's all pollen. You know, you see the bees flying around with yellow legs. Yeah. That's what they put in there. So they'll feed that to the young larvae. Look at that on that side as well. That is a full frame. That is very heavy. That is all nectar. Fantastic. That. Move on to the next one. What's your first thoughts, much? Um, <laughs> um, I don't really know. You don't know. Okay. Keep an eye out for drones. That's all pollen. Oh, see, look, in there. Mm -hmm. See all the white? What do they look like? Uh, they're like little maggots in it. They're larvae. Uh, That's all larvae in there. Have a look at that side. See all the white larvae? Yeah. I'll tell you what, when you grab your phone, put your phone in your pocket. Okay, yeah. Can you, can you press the button to take a photo? Let me just pull this frame out. Wow, look at all that. No, you can't. It's alright. Put it back in your pocket for now. We'll, uh, we'll try it again in a minute. Right. That's right, just put it back in your pocket. Do a single. Right here, we've got lots of. See all, all this is capped. Mm -hmm. That's all young young bees in there that are slowly emerging from uh, changing from larvae <laughs> to young bees. All a lot of nectar around the top is capped. Mm. Same on that side. That's all young. A lot of bees in there now, aren't there? Mm -hmm. Slowly work our way through the frames. Keep an, eye, so keep an eye out for the queen, she'll have a green dot on it. No, she doesn't have a drone here, look. Uh, where's the, where is the dot going to be? Where's the queen going to be? Hey, where's the dot? Oh, it'll be on the, on the back, the back of their head. See, that is all capped brood, look. It's all young bees changing in there. Growing, slowly growing. Right, can you see inside these little cells? Yeah. See the tiny small grain of rice at the bottom? Mm -hmm. Can you see it? Yeah. They're eggs. Oh. So those eggs will eventually turn into, they'll eventually change into the white larvae you see in here, in the other frame. Yeah, so the white larvae, see the white larvae in there? Where's the queen? I'll show you in a minute. See the white larvae in there? So the egg will change into the white larvae. Mm -hmm. It will then get capped. It looks like that's the moldy. Yeah, it does look it, but that's, that's just, they're just stored. And they're going to use that whenever they, we move the little bees out of the way. Oh yeah. Look. Can you touch one? If you want to. Can't really feel much in there. Fine. 
Oh. I'm dropping back on there. Right. That side. Oh look, there we've got a queen cell there. This one here is a queen cell. Got an egg in it. So right. That's a queen cell. This one's a queen cell. This is a queen cell in here too. Well, I believe they can create up to 20 queens, queen cells, but one of them will, the hive will eventually swarm. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. There's a queen cell there. Grab that little pot, very much. The pot blue wax. And take these off for now. This is the opener because. That's it, take the lid off. Twist it. There we go there's another inspection done unfortunately because it's so hot my phone seems to have uh, switched itself off to protect itself so it actually didn't record any of um, that inspection whatsoever so yeah it is what it is I don't really want to open the hive again um, because it's so warm Emily come here for a sec She's, it, it, is, it is very warm for a little Emily's first time in a bee suit as well it's very hot so I can't in, expect her to endure another inspection in such form. There's a lot of bees around today as well. The hive has really, really, really grown in strength. Um, what was your first thought of the hive? Did you enjoy the first inspection? Wasn't Was it as bad as you thought it would be? No. No? Oh, that's good. So, did you enjoy it though? Yeah. Yeah? And we see lots of... Bees. And And we eventually found the... Good girl, and your use of the smoker was pretty good as well. Well done, mate. You don't like Very well. Smell a bit, no, no one likes to smell of smoke. That's why you shouldn't smoke. Yeah. Um, but no, brilliant. I'm really pleased with the hive. Uh, unfortunately, we'll have to come up here again next week. Well, we'll come up here again next week anyway. But uh, we shall record. Uh, make sure I get a little sunshade for the phone. I think that might be that might be a good idea. Because um, yeah, the sun is very very hot today. Um, unfortunately, technical issues. Um, but I'm not going to let it interfere with the bees anymore. Um, and yeah, very pleased with it. They're, they're drawing a lot of comb out on the super, which is super. What we, you know, perfect we want to see. Um, there's a couple of rudimentary queen cells in there. Uh, a couple of little eggs in the bottom, so I need to keep an eye on them. I've actually removed them for today, so um, when we come back and see them again in seven days' time, uh, then I might actually um, contemplate splitting the hive next weekend. Uh, yeah, we'll see how it goes. We'll be a bit more prepared next week because obviously I didn't want to mess around too long for Amelie's first inspection because <clears throat> don't want to mess mess her around for too long or don't want to mess with bees around for too long. Um, but yeah, bees are happy in their work, so and I'm very happy with it. Uh, there's still lots of brood in there, lots of eggs, lots of larvae, and the nectar. There was a lot of nectar in those frames. Were really, really heavy, which is good to see. Really good to see. Um, and yeah, uh, they've drawn out two to three, almost two or three frames of, in the super, so they're going to start storing pollen uh, nectar up in there soon. And yeah, hopefully in, in a few weeks' time, we might be able to um, harvest that super and we'll put another one on top. We'll see how that goes. But yeah, 
see how things progress. But anyway, my apologies that you know technical fault. You couldn't actually see this week's inspection, but it's been brilliant for little Emily to come up here, and hopefully she she'll be with me on every, every inspection as I progress, or as we progress as new beekeepers. And yeah, thank you. If you'd like to carry on watching, please subscribe. Um, like this video and we'll see you again next week thank you bye say bye Emily bye brilliant